Oh, is that Bruce? Oh, don't do it to him like this. Oh, Mr. Wayne, over here, right here. This way. It's disgusting how fly you are right now. Bruce, Bruce. He know he the shit. Ignore him, dude. Do your thing, bro. Ignore him. You built for this. I got my beverage sitting right here. I almost tumbled into that like a damn Sonic the Hedgehog trying to get some rings, bitch. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up, hold up. We, we got a lot to talk about, but hold up. You just gonna throw it at me like that? <laughs> you didn't have you didn't have none of that. Hello. You didn't have none of that. Respect. Alright, look, y'all, look. I know you're probably like, Berlizzi, what are you wearing right now? Look, I got my gray beanie on. Cause obviously something's different with my wardrobe. <laughs> you know, shout out to the Rams. We doing great this season. What's up with this sweatshirt? Berlizzi, you've never worn red on this channel. <laughs> Check this out, y'all. I know it's been a long time coming. Pause! You see the shirts, y'all? You see the shirts, y'all? Now look, I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. The stream has already seen it first. Those of y'all that was there for the stream a few days ago, Yo, appreciate y'all. Thank y'all for donating. Thank y'all for showing love, hanging out with me. But you see what your boy got on today. It's a new day. It's a new time. And it's some new merch. This is my first shirt, y'all. And I'm not gonna take too much time to talk about this. You know what I mean? But I just want y'all to know, making merch in-house, meaning not signing with some company who's like, oh, hey, yeah, we'll, we'll help you make some merch, but we're gonna take 10 to 20% of the income. No, you're not. No, you're not. No, you're not. You're not gonna take any dime from me. This is one of the cleanest shirts. It's got the best fit. You know, I'm not gonna sell y'all no trash. Look, all I gotta say is look, Easy Gang merch is available at easygang.com. Who, who, who's selling merch and then naming the website based on their supporters? Nobody is. Go ahead, get you a shirt, get you a hoodie, get you a beanie, cause I know your ass is cold right now. Get your Easy Gang merch today before it's all gone. And this is all volume one. I'm not making another volume one. I might, I might, maybe like five to 10 years from now. All right, y'all, welcome back to another gaming video. It's been two weeks, and I know that some of y'all did not know where I was. I was actually out of town. I had a bit of work to do, out of town. And now that that work is done, you can check out the vlog on the main channel. Go ahead and go look at my uh, Bahamas vlog, youtube.com slash Berlizzi. I had a great time, had a lot of fun, but now it's back to the grind season, you feel me? Winter is upon us. Y'all need some videos to watch. What I have for y'all today is what's called Batman the Telltale Series. Now, we are, we are, not, we are not strangers to, to Telltale. Telltale and us, we have a great relationship. You did my boy Lee wrong. I'm going I'm to leave it at that. You did my boy Lee wrong. But the rest of y'all products have been, been excellent. Let's hope this is up to the test. That's all I got to say. Where's the sound at? You got me here You got me here talking with no music? No. I'm going to make an account one day. I'm going to make an account one day, but it's not today. I'm going I'm to I'm tell you. I'm going to leave it at that. Where's the volume at? I, I, I need to immerse real quick, y'all. Uh, look at how Bruce Wayne switched up in front of me like that. I, dude, I know who you are. 
I've seen you switch, bro. I know, I know it's you, dude. Again, Easy Gang merch, EasyGang.com. Get your raw supplies last. You don't want to look like Boo the Fool at VidCon next year with no Breezy merch. I'm gonna laugh at you. Be like, where your shirt at? All right. Okay. Episode one, Realm of Shadows. Bruce Wayne who is Batman, navigates the treacherous waters of Gotham politics as a series of shocking allegations surface, while Batman confronts Gotham's most notorious crime boss. So you're telling me that, oh, hold up, hold up, before, before I get there, select a back, uh, select a back tech color. Oh shit, this is active. Um, I'm gonna do red, cause <laughs> get the merch, you feel me? Get your merch, it's, it's red, get, get the same merch as Batman. Batman got easy game merch in his laboratory. So you telling me that Batman is being accused of some of some nonsense while trying to protect the same people who are accusing him? Batman, you need to move out, bro. Why are you still in Gotham City after all this time? You have no friends there. You have bitch ass Robin. Robin, you can kiss my ass. How about that? All right, this game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. I'm playing this one as as best as I can. Cause y'all be going in on me on my decisions, but it's like, I can't please everybody. I'm gonna do what I want. You already know something in this cup. <laughs> All right, focus, focus. Hold up real quick. Y'all already know. I'm not playing this without any subtitles. Oh, and I can make, okay, I can adjust the size on this one. Telltale, do that for all your Telltale games. Adjust the size for subtitles. You know, you know damn well I'm gonna be right here in this little corner sitting here like this. Come on. All right, focus. Who is this? Ron Burgundy? Hey, what are you? I mean, uh, damn. Damn. I didn't mean Ron Burgundy, I meant 40 year old virgin. But now he's a deceased virgin. Just trying to make, just trying to make a dollar. Okay, focus, stop. Re-elect Mayor Hill. Get it open. On it. Where are my subtitles at? Hello? Hello? Sorry, y'all. I'm sorry, y'all. I know y'all like, damn, I, he, he been gone for so long, but damn, he's still in that bullshit. There we go. How did I miss that last time? All right, apply. Let's go. Focus. Hey, you think he's gonna show? He'll bring the whole goddamn place down. Stay focused. We'll be out of here before anyone can stop us. Okay, we got. Ooh, my bad, y'all. I'm hyped though. I'm ready for this. Pat Downey. He's. Christ. He's still leaking. Move in. Why don't you move in with him? You talking about move in? That shit about to explode right now. Gordon, they're on the 52nd floor. I'm going in. Hey, wait, wait for backup. Don't need it. Take the stairs. I heard stories, you know, sent three home in an ambulance. The rest in body bags. No wonder the cops want him dead. Hey, you ever seen him? Yeah, Gotham Zoo, with all the other flying animals. I'll be honest, I don't know anything about Batman lore. <laughs> I don't I don't know much. I know Batman, I know Robin. Who is who's Gordon? Gordon Ramsey, bitch? You about to cook me a meal, bitch? Okay, circle. You about to cuss me out? Gordon, huh? Who is this? The Punisher? Ooh, you about to catch Swift. You about to catch a Swift <laughs> I didn't even hit you. Batman, if you don't make moves before this dude lights your shit up right now. Bruce, you can't keep doing this. I have to. <laughs> no one else will. Every drop of blood, everything you've sacrificed, the city is safer now. But it's made you a target. And people will keep you in the crosshairs until you're shot out of the Ooh, sky. Oh, I like that. Criminals in this city. <laughs> they need something to fear. Ooh, that's the first thing I'm gonna say? That's hard as hell. Oh, shit. 
the hell did he go? Whatever got in, don't let it get out. Y'all know damn well I wanted to say that was hard as F. I'm gonna say that's hard as Flip. I'm gonna bring Flip back. <laughs> oh, Flip. I used to say that all the time as a kid. So we going back and forth in flashbacks. Obviously I survived, but I got injured. I just gotta figure out how. What's that? Okay, this is active. Use right circuit to move the stick, then push to attack. What? Huh? Ooh! Oh! 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 Thank you. Show yourself a little bit, Bat. Okay, push X. Oh, <coughs> the hell is this? That smoke, uh, that... <coughs> Shit. What is that? What is that? Bat fart? That's bat fart? There you go. There you go. Scoop him up. You're not getting far. Press X and move simultaneously. Ooh! What next? Look at all his friends. Who is it? Batman or Spider-Man? Who is it? Is this Batman or Spider-Man? I know you're trying to. Whoa! But y'all, y'all know I'm off this drink. Why did Why did they flash back and he went? Ooh! And he was right behind him like that. Y'all seen it for yourselves. Be careful you don't turn into a monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh! Oh! The move! The move! The, the punch! The stop! Oh! What's up with it? What's up with it? Golly, th this is the calmest fight I've ever seen. You're not done yet, Pat? Batman, you're not finished. Mother teach you to knock. Who is this? Is that Catwoman? Behind you, big boy. Hey, the, the block. Damn. Who are you? Uh. Well, you, uh, you, you Batman, clearly. Stay where you are. Oh, cut You're it out. Good move, Bat. Get your ass out of here. Yes, sir. Goodbye, yes, sir. Goodbye, yes, sir. Well, if you want to be intimidating, you're succeeding. Criminals are becoming afraid of you. So are the police. It's a scare tactic, Al. Just a performance. Who is Al? I don't know anything about any of these people. I know Catwoman, I know Batman, I know Robin, that's it. Gordon Ramsay, too. Without a scratch. I'm about to take her to his restaurant. You gonna beat her ass? Hold up, you don't hate women. That doesn't belong to you. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. You broke the law. Here I am. Cut the shit. <laughs> the law. Don't tell me that's why you do all this. 
Squeeze into a suit, tie on a cape. Most people dressed up like that end up in Arkham. No one else will. I'm the only one who gets the job done. Sounds lonely. Gotta admit it, though. You give a good chase. One day you might actually catch me. Tonight. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. Then let's put you in a cage. Oh! This, this... Bring it, Bat. <laughs> They're trying to give me horny. Hold up. <laughs> okay, block that. Look at how calm these fights be. Get her bad. Get her bad. I mean, get, yeah, get her bad. Yo. This is a bad cat fight. What do I do there? Okay, there it is. There it is. Block that. Good, good reversal. Damn, there's a lot of action commands. Good lord. Damn, dude. You suck from the eye. What am I? Damn. Don't run. Yeah, get her, Bat. You get this? Move us in closer. Oh, good block, Catwoman. Nah, get off me. Oh, good dodge. Oh, it was a damn bad. Come on, I don't, I don't feel right about that. Okay, you he, he gonna slam her? Okay. Oh, damn. It's over. I wouldn't be so sure. What the hell is that, y'all? Got your ass. Got your ass. Got your ass. What's going on right now? Who's that, Gordon Ramsay? Oh, no. Jesus. Got it. Wait, wait, wait. Do not shoot. He said, let him box. Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. What do I do there? Damn, I didn't dodge. That, that, that was hard to dodge. What's going on? Why go to all that trouble for this? This man, Shit. this man, Batman, real, Myth bro. Can't be killed. You, however, are flesh and blood. God damn it! Oh, a fucking cop! If no, wait. <laughs> What is that? That should look like the plasma pistol from Halo 2. Good move. Yo, this is action packed, my boy! Are you gonna catch? Okay, I'm like, what's going on? So I, I have the option to let her fall. <laughs> That's not funny, but it's like, damn, bad. You beat her ass all over. Hold on, let, hold on, let her talk. Uh, guess I was wrong about you catching me. Not sure if it was for my sake or yours. Man, flirt with her, dude. Don't. Okay, whatever. Who put you up to this? Answer me, or I let go. But you won't. You're not that kind of guy. <sighs> Bye, Bat. <laughs> Why? Why? Man, she got that cake, though. I've seen it. 
What's what's the what's the point of her going by that? Scratch my whole side of my face. Like Step you. out of the shadows. And be Bruce Wayne tonight. Who is this? Oh, that's a much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Ooh. Well then. Time to save the city. So are you Bruce Wayne or are you Harvey Dent? Look, a lot of y'all gonna be pissed off at this gameplay because I don't know Batman lore. But it's like, what do I look like? Somebody who should know Batman lore? Probably. Uh, Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. And even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. I'm Bruce Wayne. Now, That's Harvey. Long, this city has burned with corruption and greed under Mayor Hill's authority. Mayor Hill. I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. Harvey Dent. Together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city. That couldn't have been a... Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause, he would... Sh well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late, as always. You gonna put me on hey, a spot? Hi, Bruce. Dude, I'm, I'm funding this shit. Why'd you put me on blast for? Disrespect him. Enjoy my wine. <gasps> Enjoy drinking my wine. It's worth more than most of you. <laughs> oh, he's, he's kidding, everyone. <laughs> no wine is that expensive. Thank you. Thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. <laughs> Together, we will change Gotham. <laughs> Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle, so the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave you alone. Relax, it was important. Not more than this. I know you despise these things, and truth be told, I do too. What, a chance to show off your teeth and talk about yourself to a room full of money? Say it ain't so. It's called playing the game, Bruce. And tonight, if you hadn't noticed, I'm playing for City Hall. No one came here tonight to see me. They want to see the Bruce Wayne, am I right? <laughs> And I can see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little face time with potential donors. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. Are they boys? They're the grease, they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a place for families again. Man, finish your drink. Just finish your drink. Billionaire smile and don't punch anyone. Ah, a little liquid courage before facing your adoring public. This will help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. Now all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. Harvey this makes me sound like a used car salesman. Harvey Dent, put it Which, in a crime. Which, I have not been since before law school. Nah, these are all weak. All right, all right, all right. How about uh, a new face for Gotham? Look at you. It's not half bad. That's fire. I'm gonna use that. Bruce, I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. A city free from crime, where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey, but you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Hell yeah. Well, we can start with a few hands, hmm? Come on. I'm not trying to be no politician. Out here trying to get me on my Obama shit. Man. Don't get me started. <laughs> I already got started. Let's see. Let's see how I mingle. I need you to start flirting, Bruce. Damn, this dude pounding the whole bottle. I just. Mr. Oh, Wayne, it's... I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course, I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. Her husband needed a trans. Oh, it, Mr. Wayne. Right. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street. But I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. After all, whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like you to lead this city to Dude. greatness. Well, thank you. But we're all here tonight because we want to make a difference. And that's what it's going to take. Every single one of us. There you go. Not just me, not just Mr. Dent. 
everyone. Right, right. Of course. I know it's right. Old families like ours should flock together, you know. Like birds. You trying to mate? You're preaching, dear. No, it's Dude. true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Oh, this city's luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall, that Cape Bat freak dealing out vigilante justice like it's the wild goddamn West. This dude. Regarding Golden Age, it seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but one man can't save this city. You'd be surprised, it's bitch. It's a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. Or whatever it's called. Bitch, you look like so Pennywise. On the man. Sometimes you need a person who will go off script. Such as dressing up in a bat costume? And taking out the criminals who ruin our city. Though the cape may be a bit much. <laughs> uh, don't worry, though. I am not doing this alone. And with Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state of the art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city, oh, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway. If y'all have not seen my uh, Batman Arkham VR video, it shows a quick glimpse of how Bruce Wayne's parents was murdered in the alleyway. But again, I don't know a lot of Batman lore. I'm gonna have to go back. Is lore even the right word? I'm gonna just keep using it. It feel good. I'm, by the time this second episode come out, I'm gonna do my Batman research and I'm gonna understand who everybody is in the, in the grand scheme of things. It was terrible. Truly terrible. Uh, tragedy like that at such a young age. Must have been crippling. If only that uh, deranged man had gotten the right treatment, maybe... Uh, well, I don't like to think about maybes. And I'm sure you don't either. Well, Harvey is the one who's been behind the project since day one. A vote for him is a vote for the memory of my parents. You'll have it. Thank you. Thank you both. They must be one of the richest families in the city. <laughs> Not saying I doubted you, but that went better than expected. Don't doubt me, dude. It is a night of ringing endorsements. Look at that black dude back there with gray silver hair. Cut it out. Hold up. Oh, well, hello. Who is this? Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicky Vale. Not interested. And reporter for the Gotham Gazette. <laughs> this is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. Actually, I'm here for Mr. Wayne. Well, he certainly doesn't have any time either. No, no, it's all right. You can stay. Thanks. What's up with you? What's up with you, Vicky? This is quite the social event, Mr. Wayne. No, you trying to tell me some... so formal. Trying to tell me some secrets? Hey, Bruce. Well, <laughs> Bruce. Yeah, no. Nah. Going around pleasing I'm everyone done. tonight. I'm done. But how are you doing? I'm excellent now. Please say you're you excellent. Enjoy your own party before all the champagne runs out. Well, I'm doing better now that you're here. Well, I'll tell you, if all these stuffed shirts weren't around, I'd give you the private tour. Mr. Wayne, you've... you've got something on your collar. Um... Is that blood? Yeah... It looks like... Uh... Spill uh, some wine. It, it'll come out. You stick to clear alcohols, Bruce. They never sting. You right. <laughs> Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but uh, what was that? another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. Who the hell is that? Carmine Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. Okay, Bruce, spit that game, and dude. And what kind of business do you think he's in? 
The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham, for all of us. Look, at least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. I mean, Maybe don't... can change your mind. I don't really know him, but it don't look good. Jesus, Harvey, inviting a known criminal to your fundraiser uh, doesn't exactly look good for your squeaky clean image. Let me worry about that. A word of warning, Bruce? Play nice. You know, I've been in the market for a new house. Decent walk-up, sky-high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. This thing is talking about buying oh, my shit. Good. He's talking Over about the decor offends my eyes. Oh, man, all flash, no class. Dude. Well, you couldn't afford it. Yeah, right. Carmine Falcone, thank you for welcoming me into your home. That's crazy how much money really be talking. Like, I gotta get my paper up so You're I can. A respectable man. Uh, I'm gonna play my role. I'm gonna play my Bruce role. Wayne, I know who you are. I know you the do. The guy is gonna sell me his house. He's still on Gentlemen, that. Perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Man, who is this dude? Okay, hold on, y'all, real quick, real quick. All right, sorry about that, y'all. Let's you get it. You know, Mr. Falcone, my analysts say we're raising triple what Mayor Hill. Had Hey, what's private audience? Oh, come on, guys. Bruce. You'll be fine out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. Have a drink, have a talk. Harvey, my boy. Harvey stays with us. A man's home is his castle. I respect that. Seen and not heard. Whatever you... Ah, ah. What did I say? This dude punking you, Harvey. Hold up. This ain't even his house. This is my house. And he disrespecting you like this. And you invited him, Mr. dude. Mr. District Attorney here wants to make sure the rules are followed. Falcone. But in my experience, there's the law, and there's doing what's right. You understand? Of course. And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just saying he will. The man talks too much. Chaps my face with words. I understand more than you know. Good. You look smart. You dress smart. Glad it adds up to something real. Uh, Mr. Falcone, I... No more warnings. Oh, Harvey, you... Harvey! I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. I don't, I don't care. So, let's talk relationships. Give me some pep, though. Pause. I'm Drop about to... this for me. Be a pal. Leave I can get table. Harvey the mayor's seat. Or I can pull it out from under him. Bitch. Take that funky-ass chalk, bitch. Whatever happens to being a gracious host. Okay, imagine. This is me. And these are all my friends in Gotham. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. I make them all move. And I want to keep everything moving if Harvey gets elected. That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home. Hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light. If need be. Between your businesses and mine, I bet we employ half the city. Now, we got a good thing going, so I don't see why we shouldn't team up. Okay, 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 okay. Hold up, though. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I don't know too much about Harvey Dent yet. Um, let me look him up. Let me look him up real quick. Why is this game having me do research, dude? This ain't middle school, dude. Come on, man. Okay, Harvey Dent. Let me see. I'm going to start complaining right now. Harvey Dent. Ooh. Ooh. I can't look up anymore. I can't look up anymore. I looked up too much. I looked up too much. I looked up too much. 
Oh, this should be interesting. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just keep playing this if I don't know Batman. I don't think I'm supposed to know Batman to play this game. Okay, thank you, thank you, Telltale. For Gotham, for our city. Oh, I'm everyone's friend. Which means you're really no one's. Pick a lane before you have a head-on collision. Damn, that's real. You listen to me, kid. I know, somewhere inside that tuxedo, you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands to shake. And which to break. Don't you dare talk about my father. You're getting worked up over nothing. <laughs> Hell, I knew him longer than you did. People don't say no to me. Not for long. Okay, okay, let me say this for the last time. Sorry about that, y'all. My, my computer died in the middle of recording. And all my years of doing this, th that has never happened. So, okay. Let me calm down. I think we good. I'm gonna turn these down a little bit. It's peaking way too much. There we go. There we go. All right, let's get back. Let's, let's, let's get back to work. Another week in Gotham, folks. A string of home invasions rippled through the city's already crime-infested East End. Apparently, the bandits are using stolen GCPD battery rams to force their way in, with breaking and entry incidents up 40% over last year. Remember to keep those front doors locked tonight. And we have breaking news tonight. Five criminals are in custody this evening after a break-in at City Hall. But thanks to the efforts of the Batman, the stolen items were returned. Not all of them. Let's see what she was really after. Allegations that Dent may have actually been involved in the break-in. Talk about dirty politics. As Hills can't Okay, retrieve the data the data is drive. Any water with the voters? Or will it be perceived as a desperate attempt from a flailing campaign to take down one of Gotham's most promising? Nearly fell off a building for this? This man got the ultimate setup. I know he has plenty of subscribers to be able to afford, to afford this. If my gaming is so important, you know who gaming setup looked like this? My boy Petty Gang Gaming. Yo, shout out Petty Gang. What's up, boy? What's up, PG boy? You know your setup looked just like this. Encrypted. Wayne Manor has seven bedrooms, two kitchens, a library, a gymnasium, a basketball court, and a movie theater. And yet, I always find you here. In a dark, damp cave. He working though. In front of a computer. <sighs> I'll leave as soon as I finish. People with regular jobs can do their work anywhere, but for me, this is my office. There you I go, agree. Bruce. It isn't normal work. Even worse, the best outcome is that no one ever finds out you've done it. Yeah, well, good deeds usually go unnoticed. Uh, though not unappreciated. Mm. Did you find out what that um, cat woman? Tried to steal well, in the process. Oh, don't act like you don't know who Catwoman is, dude. What are we looking at? Let me try it. That's the only other weirdo in this city with a costume. Don't act like you don't know. Okay, I'm that. I'm okay. I'm analyzing to rotate the hologram. Use L. Okay, so we got a map of the East Side shoreline, but it could mean any number of things. Money, weapons, drugs, everything flows through that port. Maybe it's where Mayor Hill picks up his dry cleaning. Hmm. Can't make sense of it yet. There's still plenty of files to decrypt. And in the meantime... I saved you what I could. Thanks, so. Al. Yeah, the same couldn't be said for the bar. I had to literally pry Mrs. Zeller back away. But you'll be pleased to hear everyone has left, including Mr. Falcone. That Before dude. the game switched from billiards to cutthroat. I'd recommend leaving the fist fights to your alter ego. 
Bloodstains are much harder to remove from a tuxedo. I don't want anything to do with Falcone. <laughs> well, he certainly showed interest in you. Who doesn't? That's what worries me. I'm the Batman. For the record, your father despised men like Falcone, thought they ruined Gotham's stellar reputation. Back when it still had one? Right. It can again, Bruce. Though people like this Catwoman aren't helping. Is she new to town? Never seen her before. Hopefully, she's just a tourist. I'll check the codex. Oh, I choose. Okay. Use the codex to look up info on the cat burglar. Got them feeder codex. Well, let's check here first. Oh, this tells me about different people. Okay, so let's look at his family. My parents, dad was a physician, mom was a philanthropist. They worked tirelessly to help the less unfortunate, setting up numerous charities and expending their vast resources to, the, to improve the city and its citizens. Murdered in an attempt robbery by a man known as Joe Chill, deceased. Wayne Enterprise, Wayne Family Butler, Alfred Pennyworth. Okay, 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 I know about you, Alfred. <laughs> Faithful, patient, ever helpful Alfred has been has raised me when my parents were murdered and guided me when I thought I was lost. My brother, my confidant, and the most secret weapon in my arsenal complains frequently about my likely activities, but he's there, still there to patch me up when I need it. So he complains when you be out running the streets trying to get some cool, but he's there to give you your medicine when the cool burn you back. Got you. Harvey Dent, Gotham City, Gotham City District Attorney, Mayoral candidate. Look at this dude Harvey, dude. He looked like a damn. He looked like Tweedledee if Tweedledee hit the gym. A new friend in the best district attempt. A new friend in the best district attorney Gotham has seen in years. His political ambitions have always been as big as his ego, and now he's hoping to become mayor. Got so many great ideas for how to save this city. I think he'll be good for Gotham, but I have to steer him down the right path to get there. He's too easily swayed by enough by anyone with power, regardless of their murky mur Okay, so he's just looking to win. There's there's nothing really that good about this dude besides his ideas. But everybody probably got a good idea every now and then, dude. Your ass, Harvey, get out of my face. Hamilton Hill, Mayor okay, Mayor Hill. Exhibit A, and what's wrong with the city? Hill should have been thrown out of office years ago, but he's got his hands wrapped up around Gotham's government in a death grip. He's been suspected of numerous crimes, but there's never been enough to make any of it stick. Wait, what? He's riding to the court and one day the city will okay, okay. He's, he's just bad. Cool. Okay. Cat burglar. Crimes. Burglary. Petty larceny. New criminal on the scene. Tied to several recent break-ins. She's effective and doesn't leave many clues behind. Currently, the Gotham City Police Department have no leads. Has no leads. That's not good grammar. I wish I knew more about her. Oh, I guess that is good grammar. Yeah, you're right. Penguin? What? <laughs> what are you talking about? Oswald Cobblepot? Get out of here, dude. He was a childhood friend, but he's almost a stranger to me now. Just like me, his family fell, up, fell apart here in Gotham. He went off to boarding school in England, and there are paths diverged. He seems to have fallen into a life of crime. The last two decades gave him a lengthy rap sheet and a strange nickname. The Penguin? What happened to you, Oz? <laughs> Oswald? James Gordon, okay, Gordon Ramsay. So he's a lieutenant of Gotham City Police Department. See, we learning together, y'all. Associates Barbara Gordon, his daughter. He's a good by the book cop in a department that doesn't trust Batman. That sucks. He was recently tapped to lead the major crimes task force and impressive promotion, so he's doing something right. I think he could be a trustworthy and reliable source of info, but I'll need to cultivate that relationship. He's a family man. So he's not willing to take necessary risks on the street. That's fine. I'll take the risk. Okay, bad. Vicky Vale. Okay, this is what I was trying to spit that game at earlier. What's up with you, Vic? Investigative journalist, Gotham City Gazette. One of the Gazettes. Okay, that must be the newspaper. Most ambitious and com competent reporters. I read her stuff. Some of it can be a bit tabloid, but her passion for the truth is undeniable. She's been with the paper for a while, covered all kinds of beats. Someone like that has the kind of access others would kill for. She might even hear more about what's going on in Gotham than I do. One day, I may need to find out what she knows. Okay, Vicky Vale. And Falcone, Skyline club owner, head of Falcone crime family. The worst kind of gay man. Falcone, you a bitch. I don't even want to read your shit, dude. 
Wait, you, how did you get money though? Mm. Okay, it doesn't tell me. Gotham City, population 10 million. It's like a living creature. It's always growing outward and upward. The people here, but the people who live here are survivors. They have to be, and they deserve better than the corruption that infested this place. An Arkham Asylum. I've always wondered what this is. Gotham City's only maximum security psychiatric hospital for now. Outdated in every way. Building is falling apart. Equipment is uh, antiquated, huh? And the staff's metho methodology metho met huh? leaves much to be desired. Uh, when the Thomas and Martha Wayne, rest in peace, Memorial Hospital opens, these patients will finally get the treatment they need. Wayne Enterprises, multinational corporation founded by my ancestors, covering all manner of manufacturing and finance. I inherited a majority stake from my father, but I'm not involved in the day-to-day -day operations. However, the R&D resources have been helpful in pursuing R&D. What does that mean? Did I miss something? Y'all know I'm off this drink. That's crazy that when I when I drink, I want to <laughs> want to record gameplay. I'm such a fucking nerd. Not much to find, apparently. A few burglaries, break-ins. Seems to lay pretty low. You could learn a thing or two from her. You can't step outside without it ending up in the news lately. As Bruce or Batman. I don't like being compared to a common criminal. No, I think you're missing the point. You have to admit you've been drawing a lot of attention to yourself. And not the playboy billionaire buys new yacht kind of attention. I don't mean to beat a dead argument, but... No one's gonna figure it out now. Trust me. Miss Vale noticed your injuries, so did Mr. Dent. If they put it together with the incident at the mayor's office, it would undo all the long nights and close calls we've endured to get here. Damn. You're in the spotlight more than ever. You have to be careful. That's real. That's real. You're right. You're right. I should have canceled the event. But I know how much pressure you're under. I don't mean to add to it. No, you good, bro. It's okay. I I know you're only looking for Absolutely. Me. If we make a suit that fits me, we can trade places some night. Nice. So I'm not partial to hunt. Mm, cut that shit out, old man. <sighs> old men worry, that's all. Old men. It's our gift and our curse. One more worry for the list. Oz. I thought I saw Oz. It's been, what, 20 years? The penguin. Last time I saw him... We were in grade school. Indeed. You two were thick as thieves. Oswald, however, took that role more literally than you. Dishonorable discharge, illegal boxing matches, arms dealing, prison stents? That's a criminal grand slam, if I'm using the expression correctly. Unfortunately, you are. Oswald claimed he only wanted to catch up, but his behavior following his family's collapse is troubling. Why he's returning now, I... He, pro faintest, I he probably missed his boy. They both had their parents lost for some bull. I think he just wants to reconnect. Criminal record or not, he's still an old friend. There you go. A lot can change over the years. That's true too, though. If I remember correctly, Oswald was fond of the old firecrackers in the toilet trick. I worry what he's graduated to. Even though you and young Master Cobblepot used to be close. Uh-huh. I'd advise you to be cautious. But I know you can't abandon a good mystery until it's solved. I'll be careful, Alfred. When you see what's become of his park, I think you will. Wow, so we're about to reconnect with an old friend. I'm just curious how this all ties into each other. This shit ain't making no sense right now. Why is this, why, why does he have a famous park named after him? Cobblepot Park, Oswald Cobblepot. <laughs> Did you sound like some Minecraft grass? Packing some cobble. What? What, dude? What are you talking about? Why are you watching this? <laughs> Where are you, Oz? Okay. Graffiti. I don't care nothing about that funky ass graffiti. Oz. Yo, Oz, stop hiding, bro. You told me to come here. Show yourself. Who is this? Damn, he, he down and out, y'all. 
You can just stare at him and keep walking. No, no, give him some change, bro. Give him some change. <laughs> Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Get yourself some NyQuil. You look sick. Who need it? Who need it? Back got it. Running late, meet you by the statue. Great. How you invite me here, but There's a statue, but no eyes. What do you want me to do? Look around a little bit? Yo, Oz! I don't care nothing about that shopping cart. Who is this? I'm about to press you. What's up with you? You know who I am? Hey. Beat it. Square up right now. Don't get sad. Oh my gosh, you're the Batman. Man, what the fuck is this? Uh, y'all remember that show, Bully Beatdown? <laughs> what was that dude name? Man, who cares with that dude name? Mayhem? I don't know. No, he, he was cool though. He beat up all types of bullies. That shit was tight. That show was active now that I'm thinking about it. You invite a bully onto the show and the bully get his ass beat for free. And you sit back and win and just take a, take a W while a professional MMA fighter beat your bully ass. <laughs> what a concept. Who is that? Who is that? Watch Wallet Cash. Oh, cut it out. But this goes through you. Are you serious? Hey, you heard him, man. Oh my gosh. The hell are you waiting for? Stay quiet. Huh? You want me to cut it out of you? End him. Gentlemen. Oz. Keep walking, all right? This don't concern you, twerp. You see, that's where you're mistaken. My old mate and I have some catching up to do. Are you uh, in the moment! Oh. Come here. I think that'll do. Oh. Oh, bro fight. Bro fight. Uh. Stay down. Oh, damn. Oh. my face boy ah uh. this used to be a nice place no lives like you don't belong mm. oh damn dude this is my park mine you hear that okay Oz <laughs> oh hey Bruce you've got a little uh yeah you too dude you too don't do yeah, Good as new. Don't do that to me. Do not do that Woo! to me. That was the right little scrap, eh? Nothing kickstarts the system like a dash of adrenaline, eh? I was active. Well, thanks for the backup. I yanked you away from your bloody ivory tower, Bruce. You invited Least me here. I can do is make sure you don't get shanked. Oh, that's very thoughtful of you. Yeah, it's been what? Two decades. And you know what? I haven't been mugged once that entire time. <laughs> uh. Yeah, that wasn't why I brought you in, mate. Right now, I am trying to recognize the little Bruce I used to run around this place with. Back when it wasn't, you know, like this. This park used to mean something. Mm. A place that was safe for kids, for families. People came from all over to visit. Oh, Mom and Dad, they put so much work in here. I'm ready to go home. Glad they never saw it like this. This place is a wreck. It's better off bulldozed. This park still matters to me, Bruce. <laughs> I knew he was gonna get mad. It's all my folks left behind. <sighs> this city chews right through people. This city some bubblegum? I mean, wait, what? Mum committed to no. Arkham. Dad ended it yourself, he did. My family's fortune, there's nothing left, Bruce. I know, Alfred told me. It's funny, huh? Same place that ground my family to dust. Gave you the good life. Used to run in the same circles we did. Hobnobbing parties, round the world vacations, unlimited potential. Now all I got is this park. And what's left in this flask. My parents are gone too, Oz. 
I know, Bruce. I know. I'm sorry for it. But I have my own funerals to attend. That's Soon fair. You know you haven't changed, Bruce. You still care about something more than just yourself. Of course. Although, I was surprised to see Carmine Falcone at your party last night. Where was you at? Made himself right at home. That oily... <sighs> Falcone was an uninvited guest. That's it. I never want to see his face again. On that, we can agree in earnest. Falcone made a stack of cash and corpses a mile high, ruining families like mine. All he needs is a little push. And it'll be a treat to watch him at pavement. Mm. Sorry, mate. This reunion got a lot more grim than I planned. Things are going to be on the upswing soon, no? A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door, and I'm here to let it in. Wow. Which brings me to you. Bruce. Uh, the dots are connecting. The... You see, you throw a rock in any direction, you break a window that Wayne Enterprises owns. As the rich and powerful go, oh, you top Gotham's list. But when my revolution starts, we're gonna smash windows and cross off names all the way down. Like I said, it's not gonna be pretty. It's gonna be beautiful. And I can't wait to get started. Are you threatening me, Oz? Take it as you like. I've got great affection for you, Bruce. I really do. Which is why I'm warning you. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. Uh, Good dude. seeing you, Bruce. But I got some rocks to collect. Cheers. This is exactly what I meant when I said politics are not for me. <laughs> like everybody out for themselves. Alfred, Prince Conference start. Press Conference for New York students start soon. Can't wait. Mm, fuck, I, I missed it. I missed it, y'all. I'm sorry. So it's like choosing the lesser of two evils. But both the evils is ugly, they're dirty. The thing about Falcone, though, is that at least, Fal <coughs> at least Falcone got money. Oswald got a dirty ass park. <laughs> Is that Bruce? Oh, don't do it to him like this. Oh, Mr. Wayne, over here, right here. This way. It's disgusting how fly you are right now. Bruce, Bruce. He know he the shit. Ignore him, dude. Do your thing, bro. Ignore him. You built for this. Morning, Mr. Dent. Hey, Bruce, you mind if we swap cars? I mean, mine isn't fast and the paint's rusting off, but boy, does she have charm. <laughs> oh, we didn't bring you all out here to discuss cars, honestly. <sighs> this dude's so cringy. We're here about Arkham Asylum. Ever since it opened its doors, Arkham has been a breeding ground for the criminally insane. Its methods for rehabilitation, crude. Its security, lacking. And worse still, those who do get out or God forbid escape, are even more dangerous than before they went in. Arkham Asylum is a cancer on Gotham. <clears throat> but today, with a sizable contribution from this man here, we break ground on a state-of-the-art mental health care facility. One that will improve the well-being of Gotham and its citizens for years to come. Beautiful. And Mr. Wayne has a few words he'd like to say. Bruce? Um, I'm here today because I want to heal Gotham, to stop the culture of crime that's running our streets. <sighs> you know, when I was uh, nine years old, let it out. My parents took me to see a movie about a hero in a mask. It was a hero who stood up to oppression and defended the people from injustice no matter the cost. That night, my parents paid the ultimate cost defending me from a man. Damn. 
who needed the kind of help this new facility will provide. Take your time, Bruce. Take your time. Let him leave. Let him use you. <laughs> My parents were heroes that night, and we can all learn from their sacrifice. Absolutely. They will eat the clown. Today, on the anniversary of that fateful night, we dedicate this facility to Thomas and Martha Wayne and usher in a new era of healing for Gotham. My controller fell. Shit. I'm uh, sure you all have plenty of questions about the new hospital, so let's open it up. You first, Miss Vale. Thank you. With the opening of this new hospital, what does this mean for Arkham Asylum? What happens to the old building? Um, tear it we down. tear down the walls and erase it from the map. Mm -hmm. I don't want us lingering on past mistakes. I want us to focus on Gotham's future. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna tear down those walls. All right, who's up next? Then I'm gonna tear down her walls. How about that? Are you there. Mr. Wayne, Julia Remark of the Tribune. I'm done. My sources say you welcomed alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone into your home. Oh, gosh. You even shook his hand. I don't make friends with gangsters. He was an unwelcome guest. That's all. Well played. Next question, please. Well played. Please keep your questions on topic, people. There you go. We're here about the hospital, remember? Read the text. Who are these people to you, Bruce? You're the man. Uh, but Mr. Wayne, I'm this out. morning the Globe received evidence of an offshore bank account managed by Carmine Falcone and your father, Thomas Wayne. What exactly are you implying? Transactions connected to organized crime going back years and continuing to this day. The paper trail ties your family directly to the mob. Care to comment? This has nothing to do with my fucking family memorial. This dude disrespectful as hell. How dare you, dude? How dare you? I just finished telling you about my parents' murder, and you accuse them of being, what, criminals? Go off, Have Bruce. some decency. There you go. Mr. Wayne, Mr. Wayne, is all your money dirty? Is the Wayne family legacy built on lies? Did you know about this, Bruce? How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? What aren't you telling us? All right, this press conference is over. Mr. Wayne, Mr. Wayne! How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? Oh my gosh! Did you know about this, Bruce? What aren't you telling us? I'm sorry about this, Bruce. I don't know where the hell it's coming from. Damage controls my territory. We'll talk later. Everyone, everyone, please settle down. I'll be fielding your questions from here on out. Please, let's try to keep this civilized. Falcone! Bruce, I've been trying to reach you. The police are inside the manor. Oh my gosh, they in my house, they just rushed me? How they how they just find a warrant for my arrest? But my family has been dealing with Falcone for years, supposedly. You can't just come bust up in my shit now. They're in here seizing property. Hey, hey, careful. Put it back. I'm afraid we can't, Mr. Wayne. Says who? This warrant. Now you gotta what? It's not personal. I had the boys turn the lights off, keep a low profile. There's gotta be a mistake. That's what we're here to find out. Maybe we made a mistake. Maybe you did. Alfred, keep an eye on them. Make sure they only take what they have to. Of course, sir. I meant what I said about not personal. We only want files related to Wayne Enterprises. The warrant covers your place, pardon me, places of residence, and any companies you own. Who authorized this? I know you and the DA are buddy-buddy, but this one came from the top. It's a valid warrant. I gotta serve it. Mayor Hill signed up on this himself. As long as he's mayor, he calls the shots. Well, Hill has a history of making his opposition disappear. Rumors and allegations, Mr. Wayne, that's all. But if they become fact, I'll handcuff him myself, same as any other crook. I don't know how your neck ended up on Mayor Hill's shopping block, but here we are. Hill knows if I go down, Harvey's campaign goes down too. 
That'd be a real shame. Mr. Dent's the only DA I ever trusted to make a conviction stick. As mayor, I think he can finally turn things around for us. For all our sakes, I pray you've got nothing to hide. The way you turned around just now. Y'all in here breaking stuff, dude? Come on, man. What is Oh, uh, please don't be a picture of my parents. Let me see it. Oh, wow, look at Baby Bat. Good Lord. You know he going through it, y'all. Bruce, stay back. Are they gonna show me the flashback? Take whatever you want. You, you don't have to do this. That's so foul. Batman's so real, yes. bruh. That's so wrong. Bruce? Is that Victoria? I, I didn't mean to interrupt, but... <laughs> you keep showing up in it uninvited. Yeah, you do, though. This is the second time you've shown up uninvited. Well, it's difficult to book a meeting with you. Well, I enjoy my privacy. Enjoyed. Past tense. Sorry, but if the press has their way, you're not going to have any for a while. Y'all can, can see me rubbing my arm this whole time? A scandal surrounding a beloved family like yours captures the public's attention. I can help you get the right kind of attention. Through my connections at the Gazette, I have all kinds of access. I can dig up whatever you need to fight this. What's your angle? Not all reporters just want a headline. Some of us are old-fashioned. I still want the truth. The Gazette received this supposed evidence like every other media outlet. And it's all hearsay. Flimsy sources. There isn't a shred of hard proof. Still, allegations like this, they, they, they don't magically appear. Mm. Someone is going after my family. After me. Mm. Obviously, the sender didn't identify themselves. We have no idea who it could be. I mean... No one's even done their due diligence on this yet. The press saw the fumble, they grabbed the ball, and ran. Hill wants me out of the picture because with my backing, Harvey wins in a landslide. All signs point to Hill. <sighs> You're a kingmaker, Mr. Wayne. And Harvey Dent is Gotham's knight in shining armor just waiting for the crown. You're the first target on Hill's list. By tonight, this scandal will be broadcast to every screen in Gotham. Everyone will be talking about it. This isn't my first pass through the rumor mill. I know the damage it can do. Then go on the record. Right here, right now, and stop it. You need to get out ahead of this. Your side is what matters, not wild speculation. Hmm. Let him talk. Honestly, what does my quote matter? Let him talk. Turn it off. Miss Vega. Yeah, come on now. But Bruce. Until I know what's really going on, I am not speaking to the press again. Exactly. Sorry, Vicky. I do not know you like that. You're gonna beat this, Bruce. The Waynes always come out on top. Goodbye, Miss Vale. I appreciate your help, Miss Vale. Get out of my house. Motherfuckers think I care that somebody's spreading rumors about me. You know how many times this happened? I hate to admit it, but don't even... everyone smells smoke. Don't get me started. The fire is heading this way. Don't get me started. Gabriel has made plenty of enemies, but my family. We've done nothing but support Gotham, even in its darkest days. Let that speak for itself. On the anniversary of your parents, it's not a coincidence. It's not. Harvey's the district attorney. He should have told me this was coming. Then find out why he didn't. Mm. You got some explaining to do, Harvey.